I'm here at Esplanade at Lakewood Ranch to showcase a brand new community that's being built by Taylor Morrison here in Southwest Florida that includes a golf membership for most of its homes. This is really a lifestyle. That's what Esplanade is about, living the life. There is a very, very robust amount of amenities that are planned and they're all in progress as we speak. And right behind me, you can actually see the amenity center being built. The largest amenity here in Esplanade is its 18 hole championship golf course. So what I'm going to do today is play the whole thing and film what I can of each hole, show you some of the houses along the way that border the course, and just give you more detail about this neighborhood in general. To get a feel for what the amenities will look like, we'll show some of the existing amenities at Esplanade at Lakewood Ranch Country Club, similar to what's planned. <music> Number two, we actually sold a house right up here on the right. It's currently being built. Be quiet as the man calls. On the second green, wow. This breeze coming from east to the west is just awesome. We're on our way to three. We got water to the right at 250 yards. <laughs> As you can see in the distance, there's a lot of construction still to be done here in Azario. Lots of land left to build houses on, I'll tell you. Okay, we're headed to the fourth tee. Sure is party. So Chris, if you wanted to move into this community, which I know you already live in Lakewood Ranch because we sold you the house, but if you did, you're looking at around 650-ish for one of the smaller homes, including golf, and you can go upwards of about 1.6 to two and a half million if you wanted to. Hey Kirk, including golf. I mean, is the fourth green. And again, another beautiful water view on the course. On our way to hole number five. That's beautiful. That's a gorgeous hole. Look at that. Get over. Pleasantly breezy. It's 100 degrees out and it does not feel like it. Cart path to six. Six has a rest stop, so it's a great chance to reapply your sunscreen and don't forget to have plenty of water. And this is hole number seven.
but I'm so frustrated. Hello to my loneliness. I guess that ignorance is bliss. Take me back to before the new. Rewind, take it out of cue. Innocence can be a young man's game. Signed up for the hall of shame. I wish I knew. West of here actually just voted to go non-public, strictly uh, private members. Their last condos were completed about six months ago. So that tells you kind of a timing of what might occur here. In. You almost hit my ball. <laughs> I meant to pick that up. <laughs> my bad. Headed to the ninth hole. Black, blue, other. left, other tees. We are other tees, Chris. <laughs> Check a box. Other. We're here in the ninth hole, hitting driver. Uh-oh, she's going the wrong way. Driving down nine, so that's the uh, driving range, the aqua range over there. And that's the first tee all the way in the distance. Hole number nine coming in and it's gonna finish in front of that building right there which is going to be the culinary center and tiki bar and all that good stuff. We just finished nine and it took an hour and 40 minutes which really wasn't bad. Pace of play in the summertime is, is faster. In season, which is winter months, obviously you're gonna be a little bit slower, so figure a little over two hours, four and a half total for 18. 10 T is right there. And from what I can tell, that's gonna be the Tiki Bar. It's looking back at the Culinary Center. 10 fairway. There we go, we got 100 yards. Oh, I just missed that bunker. Right, you can see here, this is a huge area that's just still yet to be developed. They're putting in the sewer lines, water lines, all that good stuff. Um, you see this pond here. That water level is low on purpose. But all these ponds are actually water runoff for your storm drains. All right, so we're on coming up on 11. Yes, there are alligators on all golf courses that have water in Florida. Hole number 13 actually has a rest stop with bathrooms and water, which is great.
overall, I would say a lovely day of golf. We had our good shots, had our bad shots, good like putts, it. good chips. Exactly. Donated a few golf balls to the ponds. Gotta be givers. Yeah. That's a wrap. The 18th hole as Chris looks off at the sunset. <laughs> Esplanade at Azario's golf course, really beautiful round. We're both tired, we're going home. It was a lovely evening. Esplanade at Azario, if you're interested in a home here, give me or Courtney a call, 941-348-2653. I'm Michael Chankis with Charles Ruttenberg Realty. My buddy Chris here came with me. We'll see you soon. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe to our channel for weekly updates and click the more videos link right here for more information and a playlist of videos all about Lakewood Ranch.